This is meteorologist Carl Bonak. Welcome to Upper Michigan Source Weather on Demand for October 2nd and 3rd. The official high for the 2nd, 71. Uh, the record high, by the way, was set just after the year without a summer. Uh, 87 degrees, that's the warmest for so late in the season. The uh, highest temperature recorded up on the hill at the National Weather Service uh, near Nagani of 87 degrees. 45 was the low early this morning, still well above average for the uh, beginning of October. And an interesting trend has started to develop. We had eight straight months with uh, rainfall, precipitation, rain and snow above average. August, though, was almost three quarters of an inch below normal and September almost one and three quarters of an inch below average. Will this trend continue into October? Probably not. Here's why we've got a major change starting to occur. The uh, clouds are starting to fill up the plains and the major disturbance out in the Pacific Northwest is dropping to the southeast. Here's what that means. The current pattern shows a west or west-southwest flow aloft developing. A trough is beginning to form out west. Watch what happens as we move into the early part of the weekend. That trough starts to move out into the plains. Major low pressure comes out of Colorado and heads right toward the Great Lakes. That looks like a rainy period for us. In fact, it should start tomorrow with the first wave of low pressure starting to head toward us. That'll force the front that move to the south as a cool front to come back as a warm front and create at least some rain. The best chances over the western and central UP. I think everyone will get rain by Friday morning as this wave moves to the east. Then the main low pressure area will develop with a major snowstorm in the northern Rockies, maybe even getting into the Denver, Colorado area. But for us, at least a chance of some uh, rain and or drizzle on Friday. Could be a little bit of a break, lots of clouds. The system then comes up for this upcoming weekend. Your TV six day forecast. Temperatures still not particularly cold. It looks like readings will say around 60. Warmest over the south, coldest over the north and west with uh, lows at night, rather mild actually, and a good chance of at least rain off and on.